What's up, nerdlings? What up, nerdlings? Hey, do you nerd for envelopes, stamps, boxes, parcels? What am I getting at here? Mail and mail! Do you nerd? Mail and mail. Mail and mail. Mail and mail. Mail and mail. What we have here is a package from the one, the only, Bandana Gamer. Now, uh, I didn't know that this was on its way. He'd, he'd sent us a message before once in a while, you know, hey, what's your address? I might send something your way, but was not expecting this. So, bit of a surprise. Ooh. Now, before we dive in, guess what's going to be in the description down below. It's gonna be links to Bandana Gamer's channel. You better believe it because Bandana Gamer is super, super supportive of the community. Always so positive, puts out great content, and he's hitting up people all the time. I, I love watching him interact with other people. And not only is he just a cool all around guy, uh, he's always rocking the bandana. Hey everybody, it's John Brown, the one and only bandana gamer oh well whoa oh, gosh oh, oh. for starters nice we got some cups do you recognize these i do these are the cups that only came out was it in canada i believe that we couldn't so. get and that you told me i could never use because you didn't want anything to happen to them Dude, so the Link's Awakening 7-Eleven Slurpee Cups. First so of all, cool. the designs on these are I fantastic. Are I really great. love it. Uh, I they love are, that egg up there. I don't know why. There's something about that egg. They are good. They are good size Big cups. size cups for a, a big size. These thirst. are good like pool size cups. So when you're sitting like yeah. at the lake or by the pool, fill it up with a yeah, good ice drink. But I still don't want you taking them by the pool. Someone will we snatch them. We have a second with that now. Well, see, that's the thing. Now we do have a set of these because we reached out to a friend of ours over on Twitter who lives in Canada and he hooked us up with some. But now this means we can actually use these because yes. I was a little bit of a tyrant and I was like, no, no, no. These cups are too precious. They must go on to the Zelda shrine so that we can keep them forever. But now we can actually use them. Yeah, we can. So that is Pretty awesome. Pretty cool. Uh, and as I said, the Zelda shrine, you know, just, just a teensy bit of a Zelda so fan. Cute. They the really little, are. The little button nose. They're so, so adorable. A little flower in her hair. I still think I really love the kind of panoramic look. And mm -hmm. the way that it wraps around this cup, yeah, this is still totally my favorite. You know, whenever we go on tropical vacations, I always put a flower in my hair, too. I did not see a note, but we do get to we add his business card to the Yay. collection. So Bandana Gamer, he can be found on YouTube and Twitter. Again, links in the description below. You guys have to go let him know what an awesome guy he is. <laughs> Link in the description <laughs> below. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here all week, guys. Well, clearly, these were for me. Oh. Actually. Oh. I don't get one? Because this must be for you. <gasps> Guardians of the Galaxy! So cool! Groot looks so weird. Look at him. He's like perched in a pot. <laughs> That is so cool. I saw these at the store when they came out a while back and I always wanted to get one, but I never I never popped on it. Cause these are more the, what the comic book look yes. than what the movie did. So. Yeah, so Star-Lord has a very different look here versus the a uh, bit, yeah. Chris Pratt, Peter Quill version. That's not for that one, I don't know what I'm Now the weird thing is when you look at this box, it says it's got Star-Lord and it's got Rocket Raccoon and Groot. And it says Drax the Destroyer, but I I don't see him. I don't know if maybe he's moving so slow. But my movement was so slow 
that it's imperceptible. Hi, Drex. Now you pick up a lot of Marvel Legends figures. I do, yes. So I think that you have some of the Guardians in that form. I do. Mm -hmm. But I don't think that you have any nope. of the smaller figures like this, mm -mm. do you? Mm -mm. I love these guys because these are very reminiscent to the size of, at least how I remember them, of G.I. Joe's. Yeah. I think Joe's are actually a little smaller than this, but these are the ones that are totally meant to be played with. Yeah, so cool. I love it. Got some guns and some knives. I still can't get over Groot just sitting, like, arms and legs, just sitting in a little pot. That's so funny. Star-Lord and Drax have that standard articulation that you're going to see in most action figures. You know, you got the head, the shoulder, elbows, a little bit of a chest, waist, and then everything throughout the legs, of course. Obviously, Groot doesn't really have articulation because he's not moving anywhere, <laughs> except maybe dancing when you're not looking at him. Now, Rocket, though, it looks like he doesn't move at all, but he's got a nice pose, so you can get that gun in his hand, and he's giving you the death stare because, uh, <laughs> well, I mean, because it's Rocket. He clearly. wants to kill everybody. Oh, yeah. The only problem I see here is we're missing a Guardian. I know. There's... So, do you think there's a Gamora out there? I would hope so. Gamora. Subtle. Take it back. It's kind of a little bromance fest going on here. <laughs> <laughs> it was Boys Night Out, obviously. Obviously, it was Boys Night Out. <laughs> well, uh, Marvel Toys, Zelda Cups, I think someone else here has our number. He knows what we like. So thank you, thank you. very thank you. much, Bandana. Oh my awesome God. stuff. This was such a great surprise, too. I love it. And I know it probably sounds so stupid and silly to have two sets of cups, one that you don't use and one that do, you do use. Well, maybe that's not so silly. It's not so silly. That's kind of like growing up, yeah. I guess. The the china that you don't use. Only exactly. when the fancy people come over. <laughs> yep. Yep, it's not silly at all. But I'm, I'm really happy that we can finally use some Link's Awakening cups. That's great. Um, do you think you have any room on your toy shelves, though? I can I can find some room. Are you sure? I think so. Because, I mean, if you don't, you know, we, we can always, you know, just keep them in the box and, and put them away for safekeeping. No. I play with my toys. <laughs> All right. Well, nerdlings, please leave some comments down below what you think of the wonderful gifts from Bandana. And let us know what you think of Bandana Gamer himself. If you have not checked out his channel, please do. If you have checked out his channel, drop a comment. Something that you really love. You know, let people know why they should watch him. Maybe you have uh, something in particular that you always tune in for. Otherwise, give the video a like if you happen to like it. <laughs> Comment, I already said comment. Bell, notification bell, subscribe. I won't put the drinks, to, the cups to use. I'm a little excited. A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Go over to Tee Public because we've got merchandise over there. Hit us up on the Retro Refresh because they've got merchandise there now too. And if we like it, we nerd it. And hit the drink for it apparently. I'll drink to that. Ha <laughs> ha! Hey. Another! <laughs> that he can't be seen by the naked eye. Hi, Groot. Oh, dang it. His name's Drax. <laughs> okay, ready? <laughs> Rero. Can I be a guardian, too? Nope. Here. <laughs>